Holly hanging across the door Neighbors singing tales of your It is a very gloomy day out today, but uh, I went home this morning to go to a dentist appointment that I was really late for, so they ended up not being able to take me, um, which was kind of unfortunate. Um, but it was at eight o'clock and I slept in East Boston and I just sat in so much traffic this morning. Like I left at like 7.30, I think, maybe a little bit later than that, but um, I sat in so much traffic, so I was late. And I called ahead and they said that they couldn't take me, so whatever, but um, I, you guys would have seen us decorating our tree, I think, in the beginning of this vlog, but I was just watching another vlog about someone decorating for Christmas, and I have to ask, because I'm so curious, I grew up in my household having, like, at minimum, at the height of me being, like, a kid in high school, like, whatever, my mom had, like, at least three trees in our house at a time for Christmas. And I find that so interesting also because like I love when I, <laughs> I'm like a big like house person. Like I love looking online at apartments. Like even though I'm not moving, I just like to look at houses and apartments and stuff. And I'm always looking, I'm like, oh, where would the Christmas tree go? Like that's like what I always think about. And I see so many houses that like, I'm like, oh, wait, oh you can put a Christmas tree here. You can put a Christmas tree there. And I like, with, in my future home, like when I have a house, I'm gonna have at least like three or four trees because that's just fun. Like I, my mom, growing up, our Christmas tree that like we had all of our presents under growing up was the peacock tree and my mom, literally our angel at the top of our tree was a peacock like with all the feathers. And my, it was like a bird tree basically and my mom had a bunch of birds in it and it was like a gold and blue theme and that was our tree. Um, but anyways, where was I saying? Oh, that was our tree that we had our presents under and then we had a memory tree, which was the tree that was in our front foyer and that had like beautiful, like sugary candy garland and that tree was also rainbow lights and it had all of our ornaments that we made growing up, my sister and I, and now like my nieces, the ones, um, the ornaments that they make are on that tree because my mom didn't want to be disrespectful and sh and not display our ornaments. So that was, we call that like the memory tree. And then the tree that I have in my apartment right now is another tree that we had um, that went in our living room. It was like a fancier tree. It's kind of like, I don't know what the word is for it, flocked, is that what, you, is that what it's called? When you have like fake snow on it. Um, and that had like silver and white lights, silver lights, so silver ornaments, white lights. So that was like our dainty, fancy tree. And then I would have a tree in my room 
my sister would have a tree in her room. Like, I just think it's so fun. Like, I love like the different sizes, the different shapes of trees. I don't know. I just wanted to ask that question because I just think Christmas traditions are so interesting. So, if you're watching and you have anything to say about Christmas trees, comment below. Let me know if I'm crazy or if my family is just Christmas crazy. Okay, I literally just got home. Literally watching the door. I haven't taken my jacket off yet, but I went to Costco the other day with my mom and I forget why. Oh, I bought groceries, but then I slept with Brian, so I didn't like want to bring my groceries there and then have to take them home. So I left them at my parents' house and I got the most amazing thing Costco has to offer. The steamed dumplings, the chicken and vegetable ones. They are so good. I'm probably gonna have these for lunch today. And then I got this to have for dinner tonight. This is um, the cutest little like taco pack and it has actually 12 tortillas in here. Um, and they have all of the chicken ready and then there's like some cabbage slaw and like two sauces. This was $15. I just think that this is like such a good deal for dinners. I started talking about the ornaments um, in the car and just like about what your preferences are preferences are and I wanted to show you guys a more in-depth um, look at our Christmas tree this year so I'm going to show you so this is the tree it is a pre-lit tree and I will be honest with you half of the lights have gone out so there is like three to four strands of extra lights in this tree I don't even know if you can tell but we go for a Ralph Lauren plaid theme, and I love it so much. Jacqueline picked these up last year from uh, Home Goods, and I think they're Martha Stewart brand, and I think they're so cute. And then these are from actually my sister's wedding about eight years ago, <laughs> and she gave them to me, I think, when the first year that we lived here. Um, just to add on, I love like when the light hits them and they kind of like sparkle a little bit. I think they're really cute. They look like little like snow drop snowflake things. Um, but we try to stick with like the gold theme, although there is, I'm just realizing now that these are silver, but these are from Michaels. And I just love how they add like a little pop of texture and just like dimension to the tree. This is from Michaels too, I believe. This um, ribbon that we put around it. I'm trying to think of other ones that I really love. This one um, is another favorite. This one Caitlin's grandmother got for her, and I think it's so pretty. But yeah, a lot of this is like collections of just stuff from over the years. You can totally see that the bottom part of the tree is out, but probably after this year, we'll just ditch it and throw it away. And then we have our mistletoe that we usually hang up here in this doorway but we need a tack to put up there so I have to actually text Caitlin to remind her that we need some and then this is our garland I'm obsessed with this garland my sister also gave this to me when we moved in and then we just added in these little trees which are silver so actually there is a lot of silver and then we put these little poinsettia um, ornaments into the garland and I think that's really cute and this has like pine cones and little I don't know if there are berries in this they're like yeah little blueberries sorry it's kind of dark um yeah and then we have our little um stockings and Jacqueline's always turns the wrong way so it always looks like this and me and Caitlin's always stands forward uh but yeah this is our little Christmas setup I already have two presents wrapped underneath the tree that is a first it is November 30th and I have presents wrapped already and this is kind of funny this was my Black Friday deal, $5 Christmas tree. It was actually $10. Full price $20, which is insane because it's such a dinky little tree. Um, but I got it for $5 because I had a gift card. It was $10. But. And then here's our wrapping stuff. I just got this wrapping paper, and I think it is so freaking cute. It's like a newspaper for, um, like, the North Pole. It says, like, breaking news snowman comes to life i just think it's so adorable with like a little red ribbon and then i got this one that's plaid and then i just got some boxes and some more christmas cards so yeah we're really in good shape for it being november 30th i mean i feel like we usually always um 
decorate like the weekend after Thanksgiving. So I think I'm gonna end the vlog here though. So um, I don't know if I'm doing Vlogmas. I haven't committed to myself yet, but I guess you'll see if I do because tomorrow is December 1st. So thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you enjoy my content and I will see you guys in the next vlog.